Hi everyone, it's Graham and Alex from Water Cooled Sup. Um, today we're going to talk about uh, the Super Auto Pump. It's a 12 volt inflator um, Aquamarina cell to help you pump up your paddle boards. On your big volume boards, um, it's great to have a 12 volt inflator, especially if you've got to pump a couple of boards up. So we're going to do a review on that one today. Um, it comes in a box like so. Um, inside the box, um, it's bubble wrapped. Um, the pump itself, which is this guy here, um, it has a deflator valve on, on this side. Um, you screw your hose on the other end, um, set your pressure from 0 through to 20 psi. Um, all Aquamarina boards pump up to 15 psi. Um, if you want to make life on your pump a little bit easier, you can use your, your pump that the board comes with just to put some pressure in the board and then maybe finish it off um, with your pump because you don't want to use these pumps for more than say 20 or 30 minutes at once because they will get quite warm after they've done their work. Um, they're very easy to pop on. Uh, the attachment on the end of the pump um, is designed to click straight into your valve system. So just pop it on, rotate it around so it locks into position exactly the same way you would if you're using your manual pump. Um, from there, you've got a couple of options. It comes with um, a standard cigarette lighter attachment, 12 volt attachment to go into your car. If need be, you can slide that into this piece and then attach your positive and negative battery cables to the positive or negative side of your battery if you want to run it off your battery. Um, if you don't want to do that, you can do, do, um, pop the clips out um, and then pop that straight into that cigarette lighter attachment in your car. So for me, I just pop it in, pop it into the accessory inside the vehicle, start the vehicle up so you don't cut the battery. That's all hooked up. Very, very easy. There's an on-off button um, on your inflator. Set it to 15 psi because that's what it's going to be for an Aquamarina paddleboard. Push on, you'll feel the pump come on and then kick into action. So we'll come back in a few minutes um, when that's inflated and show you the finished result. Hi everyone, Graham and Alex back um, on the 12 volt um, Aquamarina inflator review. Um, we've hooked this up to the brand new magnet today um, and it pumped it up really easily. Um, you set your pressure at 15 psi which is the highest pressure for all Aquamarina paddleboards regardless of which one you've got, whether you've got a kids paddleboard, a magma, a monster, a super tube, doesn't matter, they're all 15 psi. Um, plug this into the accessory unit on the vehicle, the, the 12 volt cigarette lighter accessory. Um, it pumped it up beautifully. If you come around here, Alex, and just zoom in a little bit on that gauge, you'll see it stopped automatically exactly on 15 psi. The needle will jump up and down a bit as it's pumping, don't worry about that. Once it's reached its max pressure, it'll shut off automatically. So it did it pretty easy. The pump is starting to warm up a little bit, so I would cool it down. If you're going to do two or three boards in a row, or put some pressure in yourself with your standard Aquamarina pump, um, pump him up like that, just to take the pressure off the pump and do the last five minutes, or say five PSI, with your 12 volt inflator. Um, it works exceedingly well. There is a deflating valve on this side here, um, and there's little spring-loaded feet on the bottom of the inflator, so um, it does jiggle around a bit, but on the ground it's quite stable, quite good. Um, I can highly recommend this inflator. It takes a lot of work out of pumping up paddle boards, particularly if you're going to be pumping up two or three paddle boards at once. Um, it's a godsend. So I love this unit. Well worth the money. Works exceedingly well. Um, the engine's still running on the vehicle. Recommend that you run your vehicle just so that you're not fluttering your back, flooding flattening the battery of your vehicle battery, unless you've got, say, a four-wheel drive with two battery systems, that might be a little bit different. Um, but it works very, very well. Very happy with how it goes. We're going to pump up a few more boards with the 12 volt inflator. For pricing or any inquiries, don't hesitate to call us at watercooledsup.com.au. This is Graham and Alice from Watercooled Sup. We'll talk to you again soon. Just a note um, on the 12 volt Aquamarina um, inflator. Um, I set the external pressure on this unit at 13 psi, which bring me in just under 15 psi on the internal gauge. Um, I played around with that a little bit, wanting to be just under the recommended 15, if not smack on. So play with your unit on 13 or 14 psi, and depending on how hot it is, the volume of your board, it may well be that um, some of the units have a slightly different calibration for the internal as against the external. 
external pressure gauges. So it's good to come in just a PSI or so under. Um, you can, of course, pump them a couple over, but just so that uh, to be on the safe side, start your unit off when you first get it at 13 or 14, and it should bring you smack on 15 PSI for the future. So just a quick note to make sure that um, when you first get unit out, just drop a couple of PSI under rather than being a couple over. Thank you.